Hi, hey, hello, welcome, or welcome back to my channel. My name is Shelly. Today, we're gonna do the fantasy fun tag. <laughs> we're doing the fantasy fun tag. So, I saw Dia over at Novel Idea doing this tag. I commented as I do on videos when I watch them. The only time I don't comment on videos is when I have too many videos, videos to go through and I sort of put them on a playlist and just go through them all <laughs> so I can at least watch them. That's basically the only time I don't actually comment or if the comments are turned off. Um, so I commented as I do and she was like, oh, well, you should do this too. You are tagged. So now I'm tagged and now I'm going to do it. So yeah, um, I did see this tag go around a lot a couple of years ago. Um, so yeah, like, like Dia says herself in her video, um, yeah, she, did she say or was it just in the comments? Um, one of them. Um, she did pull them up from like the, I don't know, the graveyard of booktube tags. <laughs> what am I on about? Oh, wow, who lets me do this? Nobody. I'm sorry, dear. Um, anyway, so since I'm now tagged, I'm not gonna do, I'm not, I'm now gonna do the tag. Wow, what is up with me today? What is up with me ever? No. Okay, questions. Let's go let's go into the questions now. <laughs> Question number one. What fantasy world would you want to live in? You will not have any magical powers, you'll just have your own regular person abilities. <laughs> Ooh, scary thought. Scary thought. Well, I would die in about two seconds if I was in the fantasy world with just my own personal abilities, which are <laughs> non-existent by the way. <laughs> um, maybe never ending story because Bastion seems to, you know, make it through more or less. Also, I haven't seen never ending story in such a long time. I used to love that movie. I used to cry a lot when I watched that movie, but I used to love that movie. Also, the theme to it never ending story. Na, 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 na. Sorry for my singing. I'm absolutely horrified. Question number two. What kind of fantastical being would you want to be? Well, I've always wanted to be a witch. That's a fantastical being, right? I'm gonna go with it. <laughs> I've always wanted to be a witch because that just seems like hella fun being able to do stuff with invisible powers just coming through you yeah why am i not a witch what that why am i not a witch who do i talk to about this someone make me a witch <laughs> pretty sure that's not how it works but sure <laughs> Question number three, for your everyday life, would you rather have magical powers or a magical pet? Ooh, that's a hard one. Hmm. I think I would rather have magical powers myself, because, you know, witchy stuff. Uh, <laughs> but also, if I had a magical pet, would they have magical powers too? And would they use them against me? Because I feel like that would happen. I feel I'm that unlucky that I would have the magical pet that would destroy me with their powers. But if I could have a dragon, that would be wicked. Question number four. Who is your favorite fictional dragon? Sadly, I don't know too many fictional dragons. So I guess I'm gonna have to go with Sephira from the Inheritance Cycle because I've just read that one and it seems plausible. <laughs> She's a good dragon though. Yeah. Oh, there was this movie. Well, I think there was like more than one of them, but I think it was called like Dragon Heart or something. And that dragon has the same kind of vibes like the arrogant inheritance uh, cycle dragons. Wow, that was a lot of words. I don't remember what that dragon's name was though. 
but I think the one I saw was like Sean Connery was the voice of the dragon and that was pretty wicked. <laughs> Question number five. What is your favorite fantasy movie? Technically, I think it's more of a mini series, but I always saw it as a movie, a full movie, because I think we had it on VHS. Yeah. Anyone remember VHS? <laughs> um, and, uh, wow, that ran out. Wow, wow. Anyway, the movie or miniseries I'm referring to is Merlin with uh, Sam Neill and um, Isabella Rossellini and Miranda Richardson and a whole bunch of characters, characters, actors that are so good. I love that movie or miniseries. I, I think, yeah, I've seen that in such a long time. It's one of those that's super hard to get a hold of as well. Question number six. If you could make one side character from a fantasy series a main character with their own story, who would you pick? Well, I always wanted Fred and George to have their own spin-off. But I mean, seeing as uh, at the end of the seventh book, one of them is not alive anymore. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Um, but those were always like my favorite characters because they were so funny. I just like the bands. I like the bands. Well, I tried my best. <laughs> I hope you got some new like inspiration, information, I don't know what to call it. Some other answers than I normally just put out. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Uh, anyway, thank you so much for watching. I shall see you all next time. Until then, take care. Uh, bye bye.